Pixogun 3D PC edition is less than seven days from being released, and I managed to get early access. So let's check it out. So here is the basic tutorial featuring official keyboard and mouse support. So this is the basic tutorial, which I still think is very outdated. But nonetheless, let's see how we do here. So we can shoot. Left is to shoot. Left is to shoot. R is to reload, of course. Is there a scoping button? Not on this. To be honest, it should have give you a weapon with a scope. All right, so it says we got to follow the robot. So let's go all the way up here. And then let's go straight into the helicopter. Bro, the quality of this looks so impressive. I'm actually relatively impressed. And obviously people are going to be using these uh, buttons for uh, three cat spam. So that will be interesting. So scope it. Ooh, quick scoping is going to be a thing for sure. But it feels really weird playing this. But I'm actually like excited at the same time. Here we go. So you have to play one game if you're a brand new account. I think as of me recording today's video, there isn't any account transfer right now that will be available upon launch. Now, grenade, bro, I'll tell you one thing. It's going to be great using a controller on this. It does feature controller support as well. I know that much. Oh, bro, I'm going to be cracked out on this. I'm going to be cracked out. <laughs> <laughs> the graphics are impressive. I, I have to admit, the graphics do look so much better. And then let's just go and check out the settings because that's something I'm highly curious about. Here we go. Here we go. I've been playing a lot of Fortnite on PC recently, so I'm not too bad. Here we go. Where are you guys at? Keep keep showing. Nothing. Oh, okay. A bot that did not want to die. Get rid of you. And you. And you. Ooh, 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 ooh. We're going with the heavy. We're going with the heavy. Get rid of him, boys. Let's go. Reload. Default's cracked out of its mind. I do see him over there, too. Bro, I'm looking forward to this. I can see so much, too. Now, I'm, I'm curious if I could alter my armory and settings. Okay, you kind of can. Guess we'll do this on the main screen, though. Let's just focus on, like, cracking some players here. Here we go. Oh, missed. Missed. All right, we're going with this. We're going with these boys. Here we go. Default pistol on top. You're dead. Listen, bro, put that thing down. My guy had... Was that the uh, the the ghost saw? The screaming saw? Was... Did he have that already? Bro, this is my first game. You can't be cracking out weapons like that. There you go. Double kill from your boy. I actually don't have any bullets right now. But we are. We are popping this off. Okay, so... Uh, tab. Shift. Bro, listen. How have you got that? <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. This will show you the leaderboard. Okay, that's pretty decent. Let's go. Hit him. You can actually stay scoped in, which I like that. Very slightly different from the uh, the controller support. All right, let's mess around with the settings. I'm curious on the settings that are different compared to the PC mobile version. I have access to the brand new tournament mode. I might make a second video on this, but in order to get to this level, I have to earn 140 XP. The user face looks so much cleaner on PC compared to... To the mobile version so i do actually like that gift for your purchase i know for a fact though that these deals are going to be very popular if they are available from day one i think people should definitely purchase these it looks like we do have access to account transfer or deletion where you are able to transfer your accounts from one device to another from my understanding you can transfer from ios to pc android to pc but you can't currently transfer from ios to android but that is being worked on the next settings these practically look the same as the mobile version apart from the fov is defaulted at 80 instead of 60 i usually play a little bit higher so we're gonna bump that up as for controller support yes if you plug in a controller you can use something like an xbox controller next setting you have music lobby 
in-game chat emojis and notifications and also a brightness option as well to make it brighter and there is a streamer mode and this is very new it says turns off game chat turns off display of custom cape skins and clan logos turns off friend invitation notifications so that's pretty cool language is available and then we do have the fps option which can be 60 you can lower this right so we got 30 60 120 144 165 240 or unlimited this is good and we also have the resolution options as well and they do have the screen mode borderless window i think it's full screen windowed again i'm probably gonna stick to probably borderless windowed and then we do have vsync anti-aliasing as well so these are settings you're able to customize to your own satisfaction as for controller settings they did have to tweak these which is why they're kind of messed up on the mobile version as for the pc controls they seem pretty standard i think you guys understand how to play keyboard and mouse and just focusing on ranking up a little bit now obviously it is the current event where the stardust is available I guess I'll take that. That's a unique weapon, right? Space Blaster? I haven't seen that in a very, very long time. Which means I've also completed another task. Which leaves me with play one match on the Classic Pool map. We also have access to the mailbox. Great news. With the launch of PG3D PC Edition... I'm going to be live streaming the PC version on the official Pixelgun Steam page. So make sure you guys stay tuned. I'm going to be giving away a bunch of bundles. But everything seems to be quite fluent. The gameplay seems to be quite fluent. Everything seems to be very functional, which I think is a massive positive. Obviously, you would have to go ahead and purchase the Pixel Pass currencies. Believe it or not, guys, I've actually managed to find some players. Some actual players, not bots. Brand new, obviously brand new players. Because currently right now, it will put you in games with mobile players. There we go. But I know you guys are going to have a lot of questions. So if you guys do want me to test some things, feel free to let me know in the comment section for sure. But I'll tell you one thing. We have realistic water in Pixelgun 3D. Before we have GTA 6. Is that not a huge a huge dub for the Pixagun players? I think it is. Now, the controls play really well. I've not really struggled. Here we go. Get rid of you. I, I'm, I'm having fun. <laughs> I'm having fun for sure. Let's try like... Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Get rid of you. Here we go. One more time. How many shots do you require? How many shots do you require? Thank you. Can I, got, I, I, want, can I rock a jump? That's the question. Can I get up top? Of course I can. Pixel Gun 3D. Of course we can. Oh, he's got up top too. He's got up top. No, 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 no. Bro, you don't see me. No, he does. He does. Julius. Julian. Get rid of him with this. There we go. I'm gonna reload this beast too. I'm in third place. Bots on this game are built different. Gotta get closer with these kind of weapons. Listen, man, I'm not dealing with you. I'm gonna throw a grenade back at you. There we go. Second place. Uh, second place. I can't believe we got the realistic water. That is like massively surprised me for sure. I don't know who's in the lead, but I'm here to take over. Oh, dude. Adrian. Bro's popping off. I'm sorry. Dude, how many shots? Finally, I got him. I reckon he's in the lead too. Full of kill. Uh-oh, 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 you don't see... Oh, dude, you don't see me? What's the score? I mean, this is a close game, boys. This is a close game. Listen, man. What's that all about, huh? You're stealing your boys' kills. The graphics is quality. Yeah. Come to me, bro. Come to me. I'll take them. I'll take them all. Let's try this. Eat. Snipe. I'll tell you one thing, though. Cycling through the buttons a little bit. Like, one, two, three, four requires a little bit of scrolling sometimes. That'd just be my uh, keyboard and mouse. So don't let them get you. That's a bot. But I'm surprised I'm actually playing players. Now, one thing mobile players will have the ability to do is turn off crossplay. So if you are a, a mobile player and you don't want to play with PC players, you can actually prevent that for sure. Oh, man, I'm coming back for you. I am coming straight back for you. 
Yeah, I'm trying to scroll. Scroll. There we go. Hit him once. Twice. Three times. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad I purchased this now. What? That's not enough to kill you? Finally. Grenade out. That's got to be a kill. It's got to be. Yeah, of course it is. Got to get in the water and hide. One more. <laughs> it's good. Yeah. Playing all my favorite maps. Keyboard and mouse is fun. Very, very fun. One more kill would be very nice here, but it's not going to happen, is it? I got a dub as well, bro. I'm ranking up. 31 kills. Your boy has got it. Even with keyboard and mouse. Let's see if we get anything good inside of another chest. But the game is fluent. I've had no problems. They've done a really good job. I think them delaying it by a couple of weeks has worked out really, really well for the whole Pixel Gun community. And I think players are going to enjoy this massively. I'm loving the cursor. I love how the, the game works. Everything works incredibly well. Now, there's one more thing I do want to show you because I do have access to the brand new tournaments. So that is highly likely going to be one of my next videos. So if we come off here, go to rewards. We got this. Hey, I got another cheeky little chest here. I'm hoping for like parts for the Desert Fighter. It'd be nice to start. Hey, <laughs> the game listens. It'd be nice to get the Desert Fighter on this account. But then if we go back to battle tournaments, so we do have access to the brand new tournament select mode random team fight and deathmatch okay anyway uh if you guys want to see some gameplay of the brand new tournaments just hit that like button check out paradise resorts it's been given a graphics update and things look so much better i'm not going to go through all of the maps but it just gives you a rough idea as to what they look like they have ported them over very successfully and give them a boost in graphics more shadows, a lot shinier, and things just look so much cleaner. Especially if you're playing on a pretty decent monitor as well. So props to the developers. I'm excited to see where they go from here. They did such a good job on porting the PC version. Who knows, this might actually eventually end up on console. Maybe on a Switch, maybe on Xbox, maybe on PlayStation. But I have to come and check out this because this is more of a modern more updated map and i just wanted to see how this compared to something like paradise resort here you go here you go here you go uh, that building does look like is that is that building always been like that <laughs> i don't think i've ever seen that before <laughs> looks like it's got a giant hole in it but yeah I, i'm impressed with the pc version if you guys have any questions or queries about this or things that you would like me to test just let me know in the comment section and i'll be sure to test it out in a separate video have a wonderful day.